Everyone loves the smell of Scooby Doobie's flower. You'll want to smell it all day. Oh, man, I can smell this all day. Calm down, Connor. I just said that. With flavors like berries, pine, Connor, spicy, Connor, and gas. Are those beans? Connor? As a world-renowned scientist, more specifically from Canada, I've proven here that terpenes can be found in both cannabis and vegetables, which makes it undoubtedly so that weed is vegetables. For more information on Scooby's Doobies, go to ScoobDoob22 on Instagram, or for delivery straight to your door, text 716-304-0866. A fucking pen 15. Wow. Wow. Can you, do, can you do that now? Can you? No, nah, he's going. Yeah, see? No, there it is. Let him he do still it. can't do it. No, he, can't he still can't do I, it. Fucks right. up my shit that's every time. Right. No, it's Wrong. never right. I don't understand what I'm doing. And we are, yeah, that's apparent. That's apparent. Wow, wow. <laughs> like, nah. Drop the last nah. wah part. Yeah, and you no got it. It's wow. And then. See, it just <laughs> stops. Yeah, right. yeah right. you're gonna do it again. Yeah. So I tuned in today. Where yeah. are we at? Spaced out podcast. Spaced out Damn podcast. Right. Yo, have we reached? A we have Mr. Pyrex man himself, mm -hmm. Mr. Ah. Montana himself. Oh yeah, ah. Mr. Motherfucking Seven One Six himself, Mr. BSF, yes, Mr. Sir. Big BSF, Big BSF. Betty the Butcher coming. Oh, there it hey. is. That's there it is. We need it. We the need it. Butcher's that. coming. He's yeah. here. Nah, he's, he's here. here. He's arrived. Yo, in the space. He has arrived. We just do the game thing. day. Yeah. Space oh, anything. Woo! I mean, we're not worthy. We're no. Yeah. Like, no. Not like, worthy. Yo, we appreciate like, you for real. Absolutely. Yeah, we like skip some by. steps so we know. Mm -hmm. It's all love, man. Appreciate you having us. It's all love. Like, yeah. This, yeah, man. Appreciate exactly. you. The Lord works in mysterious ways. Yeah, it does. Fucking hey. Appreciate you, bro. Love, love. <laughs> we did it, guys. <laughs> Woo! We can reach in his, That's in his game day, right? Yeah. Game day. Game day. Game day. It's fucking Fuck holiday right now. Yeah, what's your prediction? Oh. Uh, honestly, I, I, I feel like we're going to win, but that fucking Derrick Henry, he, he give us trouble mm -hmm. every time. I think yeah. we're going to stop him today, though. Mm -hmm. Yo, that defense was on point last week. I'm happy week. it's raining and wet out there. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. I don't need that. Dude, I yeah. woke, yeah. Up, I woke like, up. The sun was out. Yeah, I, I woke like, up and I was like, yo, this is... This They're going to hate today. this. Perfect. Oh, yeah. It's game day weather. Yes, perfect sir. game. Yeah, be seeing a little bit of like, some snow on the ground would be just perfect. I'm going I'm going game. down there. I'll be down there uh, hosting a fucking uh, chicken wing eating. Hell, yeah. Nice. I'll be there. Hell, yeah. I'll yeah. Nice. eat some chicken wings. Yeah, you tried to get in just, on that, didn't you? I tried, but I think it was too late. But I'm yeah. just going to show you were just up. Trying to, you were just trying to get into the fucking round or you could like yeah. put them away. Yeah. You could, you could. I'm just going to go there and eat chicken wings. That's what he was trying to do. I'm going to eat the wings. Yeah, right. Passing out wings, you know? Exactly. I know, but shit. But no, I knew y'all were going to be there, really. I was mm -hmm. like, oh, man, wouldn't that be a way to impress them if I get chicken wing sauce all over me? I would I would have been impressed. <laughs> Seeing you yeah. in the contest, I'm, yeah. I would have been impressed. No, man. Yeah. You know, people making bets, you know. Yeah. No Might sauce. Like on, on, yo, if you, you would have got no sauce on the Wave God shirt. Yeah. That would have oh, been the most yeah. impressive, right? Impossible. Right. Impossible. That yo. might be a good bet for later. Like, who get the least who sauce? The least sauce. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 All right. All right. All right. This is what you guys don't know about the Wave God shirts that they come with sauce on them. Oh, the sauciest <laughs> fuck already! Real Damn. Hey. You know what I mean? Yo, I'm wow. <laughs> wow. That is, that is uh, right there, that, that we was. are excited to have you here. Yeah. Especially with all you know, your busy, busy ass day. You just showed up. I don't know. You if just you said hello in? to anybody yet? Yeah, man. I just landed. I just came back from Vegas. I was out there working mm -hmm. in the studio. With you him. left, came back, or you came left, mm -hmm. came back. Yes, sir. This mm -hmm. man don't stop. I don't nope. fucking stop, bro. No, I can't. no, no. Yeah, yeah I was Damn. just looking at Yo. the. Uh, they don't even have like, the ones that before 2015, but since 2015, 15 albums or <laughs> EPs have been dropped to this day Sheesh. from you. And that's crazy. That's and that's, crazy. Like, and that's like you're right. And that's the shit mm -hmm. that they know about. When I first started, when I had about three of those, I'm like, man, I got like. 30 oh. shits they don't even know about. Yeah. Right. That was like my my underground. I was trying to my, find it today. 
How long does that go back? Up to I, my old school. Oh four. I saw you on 04? late night noise. Did you ever have anything yeah, on late night noise? Definitely, I was on late night noise. Okay, you know that. Yo, oh four. Oh four. That was the shit. You know, yeah. City Boy. That's my right hand man. He used to oh, be yeah. the host. Oh yeah. All right. he used to be the host of the yep. motherfucker. Yeah. yeah. Nice. And then, um, because uh, I got put on, my brother brought this joint home. It said B E N N Y. What year that's was this? That's the title. That shit was like. Oh five, oh six. Right, right, right. right. Yo, that shit fire. <laughs> and shit. then Ken, Ken Journey mm-hmm. went to South Park with him. He listening to you, and I'm like, Yo, who this? My brother's listening to him. Mm-hmm. This man listening to him. All right, let me listen. Fire. I'm in Iraq listening to you. Oh That's nine. Crazy. That's yeah. crazy. Motherfuckers wow. is like, Yo, who are you listening to? Yo, mm-hmm. He's not. They not gonna make it that that grimy shit out. Mm-hmm. I'm like, okay. Okay, mm-hmm. and then boom, you drop like y'all became big. I pushed it in all they faces. Mm-hmm. Like, look, look. <laughs> yeah. I said J Cole Dude. was gonna be the greatest. Look, look who's there now. I'm oh, when, when seeing them all fucking top from Buffalo. They like, oh Buffalo, Canada, blah blah blah. Go to Buffalo. Go to Buffalo. Yeah, yeah. I know what it is. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know what Nobody it is. Nobody believe Absolutely. me. I moved yeah. to California. Yeah. If you care about cannabis and you haven't checked out the Roaring 420s Lounge, you might not care about cannabis as much as you thought. These guys are the first cannabis market research company in New York. They accept donations of cannabis products for testing at a state certified laboratory, share the tested products with their private members, and collect surveys about effects and taste, medicinal value, and more. Their data has helped 43 local vendors improve their products and grow their communities, and taught a lot of consumers a ton about safe consumption they're accepting new members right now with events running all the time for $25 a day you too can sample anything on a huge menu while helping the Western New York cannabis community grow sign up at r420.me or stop on in at 794 French Road cheek to New York open every day except Tuesdays 3 till midnight ask about saving some dough and weekly and monthly memberships too we're here at Smoke Dogs Dispensary. Let's take a look inside. Smoke Dogs this Saturday, that's right, tomorrow, the special spooktacular event at 551 Mile Strip Road in Irving, New York. Smoke Dogs, yes, we're open. Dope to be able up. to, you know what I'm saying? To yeah. be able to stand in the in the forefront of what's happening right now in Buffalo hip hop. Yeah, because yeah. that's, that's important. Amazing. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's Super. important yeah. that we have that kind of culture tied to the city. Sure. Yes. We never had 100%. it. No. Forever. Mm-hmm. Well, it was I mean, there. Yeah, yeah, it was always there, there. Right, it, it was, was always there. there. Y'all it was underground. Yo, the right, right, art right, right. that's right. in Buffalo, like just art. In itself, the yeah, artists from sure. poets to fucking drawing, music, and art. music everything. everything in this city. Yeah. Yeah. Buffalo Super art scene is a motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. 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 sleep yes. on it. Yeah. Creative. Dude, I've been you, right. creative you look around people. and you're like, yo, there's yeah. art everywhere. I think I'm the only one not from Buffalo, mm-hmm. but um, this is fucking home. But you still so fucking yeah. I, 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 Man, I love fucking Buffalo. Yeah. I ain't never leaving. Yeah. Y'all are like, you're stuck with me for life. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I, I, mean, like I, mean I, I used to live out in California, you know, up yeah. in Cali. I, here I am. Yeah, I moved to Cali. Bay. Y'all blew up. I came back. I was like, yeah, yeah fuck it. I'm coming back. Fuck this place. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, here yeah. we are. Absolutely. You got the whole city wanting to be rappers. Yeah. Without man, as they should, man. They following mm-hmm. in our footsteps. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And and more, more footsteps far as, like, the hustle. Yeah. You know what no, I'm saying? No. Like, uh... 
it can happen. You know what I mean? Yeah, absolutely. absolutely. Sure. Nobody thought it was possible. This shit possible. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? You got like, not even West Side Gun, not even me. Yeah. You got Rick fucking high. Yep, monster. You know what I mean? You got this like third generation type shit going he the on. Yep. I said the hustle, he the Kanye of Buffalo. Yep. Period. Yep. Real yep. shit. You said that. Yep. Kanye was shit. on there. He said Kanye fucking a Buffalo, Buffalo right there. there. Yep. Yo, my man Rick is a high. fucking beast. Yeah. For sure. And they don't even know the songs he fucking produced. Right. Wow. Like my first, like we we made sure Rick High produced everything. He produced the Me and G Herbo track uh, years ago. He yep. produced the Me and uh, French Montana track years ago. Every time I was getting a feature, I was making sure Rick High produced yep. the track. Nice. Well, Back then, like 10 years ago. You know what I'm saying? Feeding him. Yep. That's just That's fire. Dope, like, yo, dude. do this beat. Yeah. 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 Take this crazy. Off, you know? Crazy. Take this I love it. From Shay. Oh, yeah. Carry no doubt. Talk about Shay. That shirt. That shirt fire. Oh, yeah. Shay. Oh, yeah. That oh, shit on DJ the, Shay. Yo, All that right shit now. on the motherfucking billboard while you driving down the 33. Yeah. Yeah. See that? Look, yeah, look yeah. up and you just like, yo. You know what I love that about that kind of shit? Fire. Yeah. You know what I love about that kind of shit? Mm-hmm. The Buffalo billboards. It's like you guys already have the fans in Buffalo. Billboards mm-hmm. are to get more customers and shit like that. That's not what these billboards are. This no, is no, just, no. Yeah. It's just love. Just to show DJ Shay love, man. Yeah, man. Show the city that we work in it. And I love that. Where it is. Yo, it's the perfect spot. Perfect too. spot. East it's side. like, yo, you you look up and then you come down that billboard. Mm-hmm. And you're right, right in there. the hood. Yeah. As soon yeah. as you, yeah, as soon as you make that turn, yeah. you know what I mean. But man, we love Shay, man. We miss Shay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We're trying to keep Shay's name alive. Man. For sure. We're gonna yeah. forever keep his name alive. Yeah. When you see me, when you see Rick, when you see him, when you see the gang, you yeah. see you see Shay, man. See Shay. Yeah, yeah. yeah absolutely. Yeah. You know what I mean? And we love Shay. We miss him. So we don't represent. Him. When's the first time you worked with him? The first time I worked with Shay was my boy was re-recording his album so he was uh doing it at Shea Crib at Shea Studio so I went there to spit my verse and then Shea heard the verse and he went crazy you know what I'm saying and then me and that nigga been like this ever since yeah real shit yeah yeah I was like 19 you know what I'm saying that, that shit crazy here. that so nigga Shea first. man that nigga Shea a genius Niggas can't yeah. fuck with shit. Yo, his you know beat I mean? patterns was crazy. Real shit. He was, a, he was a sponge, too. He could learn anything. He can adapt in any room. And uh, he knew how to, he knew how to uh, like, push the talent. He knew how to push us. He knew the right yeah. shit to say to us. He knew the right moment to, you know what I'm saying, to push our buttons and to, to encourage us. He, he knew how to do that shit. You know what I'm saying? Right. It's like coach. A, yeah, I yeah. was just about to say, like, it's a coach. coach. Yeah. 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 Because that makes you the quarterback. He used to be talking about, like, yo, yeah, you're the greatest, yo. you're this, yeah. you're the top nigga, you this. And I'm like, I used to be in my head, like, nigga, you sure? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, what's this dude talking yeah. about? Right. Honestly, that's sure important, sure man, because yeah, yeah. a lot of you, it's your company, man. The company you hold is a lot of what you turn out to be. You know, you've got a bunch mm-hmm. of people worried about. Absolutely. You know what I mean? Themselves. Real shit. Instead of pushing the next guy. And you mm-hmm. end up with, you know, just a bunch of people doing this. Y'all yeah, pushing squat. each other up. Right, 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 right. Yeah. 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 Team to the team is it. the team is is one of the most important things. Wow. Because mm-hmm. when you see Benny the Butcher, you do I'm not here by myself. I'm talking right. about people who don't even rap. Wow. Yeah. Right. You right. Know what right. Right. You pay great homage. Real shit. Sure, no doubt. Nah, we oh, yeah. just like Ken. But you he he did some shit for you back in the day too, right? Well, that's my cousin. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you know yo, I mean? and I was like, yo, he's like, yo, that's my cousin who spits, and I'm like, mm-hmm. yo, this shit's fire. Real and we in high school and he just jamming to you. Nah, Going to school, yeah. coming home. Hey, yo, that man worked too. Put mm-hmm. in that work. And I'm yeah. like, yo, damn. He ended up recording 17 bullets for me. Yeah. Yep, that yeah, whole nice. EP. He recorded yeah, yeah. the whole motherfucker. And he'd tell you, I recorded that shit in an hour. Did he tell you that? Nah. I recorded six songs in an hour. Shit. Thanks. That's yo, I try to get that joint though. That BNNY tape. I want that <laughs> shit. My brother lost that shit. Mm. Fuck man, that's gas. That's gas, yeah, man. Yo. Tapes, yo. I be trying to find them shit, yo. They... Speaking of buying tapes over, yeah. shit like that, you got a favorite album? I bought The War Report about a thousand times in my life. Mm. Well, of course, I'm always going back to Reasonable Doubt mm-hmm. and Murder Music yeah. by The Mob. I'm always yeah. going back yeah. to those. I'm always oh, no. going back Classics. to... Motherfucker, the get classic. rich or die trying, yeah. and shit like that. I'm always going back to the classics. Remember I'm the way back to I just am. before get your get rich or die trying came out. I don't know, it's like Bur- Buffalo, like just started really getting into the mixtapes from New yeah, York yeah, and yeah. shit. Just shit was going crazy. Man. Mike Pratt was at doing Did his shit. Yeah. Her, yeah, DJ Big Mike. You know what I'm saying? DJ Big Mike from Buffalo and Big Mike from mm-hmm. uh, 
out of uh, Connecticut and shit. Mass. Yeah. The mixtape yeah. game was crazy. I came up during the mixtape game. Yeah. yeah. You know, motherfucking the DVD era. You know what I mean? Uh, that shit, that yeah. shit was amazing. Yeah. You and Conway. <laughs> Just thinking back at that era, that era was crazy. Yeah, it was a crazy, yeah. crazy yeah. time. Yo, so you literally you, from you had to yeah. learn how to fucking rap then. Yeah. 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 It wasn't all this cute shit. Yeah. And y'all was no. doing it right on the corner, right there in there. Exactly. Freestyles. Right the Freestyles. Because yeah. the camera was no, on you. Yeah. This was before because it was. There's no editing. The camera was on you before. You got a chance to go buy a chain mm-hmm. before yeah. you got a chance to go buy a rolling. Yep. The cameras right. was out, right. so yeah. it wasn't about none of that shit. Nope. It was about, it was about like nigga, what the fuck you about to say? Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah. Now yeah. it's yeah. now it's different. No man, you know. Uh, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. you got. Yeah. You've had many different names, Jeremy. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> wow. So uh, Yo, well, I don't get mad when people call me my government name. It's my name. I didn't think he was going to pull it. I was going to pull that shit. That's funny. You can't. Yo, it's weird when people get offended when they get called by their name. No, no, no. It's just your name. To be honest with you, I always used to think, man, Christopher Wallace is like this fucking hell of a name. Right, right. Not that Notorious B.I.G. isn't, but like Christopher Wallace. Yeah, no, that's a big guy. Seriously. Yeah, no, that's a, yeah. It brings a presence. Yeah. Like, yeah. Seriously. Yeah, that brings a presence. Like my shit the same way, like Jeremy Pinnock. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So yeah. what Sticks. the fuck? I was like a conqueror's name. So. Yeah, for real. So it rolls yeah. off like really well, man. Just, you know what I mean? So but I mean, look, this, his name right there. This is the thing about names. I know who you are or how well we know each other by what name you call me. Okay, right. so let me ask you this, Jared Bear. Where'd you come <laughs> wow. up with that? went there. That's too much. <laughs> yeah. he went there. That's too much. <laughs> let no. me get to the question. Though. Where'd you come up? Where's Benny come from? And then where did the Benny the Butcher part get at? Benny came from uh, Carlito's Way. Okay. okay. Benny, I yeah. yeah. go from the Bronx. Yeah. All right. One of my homeboys, somebody who I admire, when I was a uh, young guy in the streets he was an older guy in the streets and i i ran under him and he he was he's one of the dopest niggas i ever heard rap yeah. on a mic still to right. this day so anyway he said something he said the name benny in a rhyme and i had never seen a movie at that time so i went back seen the movie and then i changed my name to like yeah. benny bravo off of that at All first right. it was desert eagle oh, oh yeah that's what we was getting yeah. to it was that's desert eagle. Wanted somebody got like a new toy huh i mean and then <laughs> And then I go to motherfucking Benny Bravo, and then I fucking dropped the Bravo, ran with Benny. When I got nice and had my foot on these niggas' neck, I made it an acronym. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Best Uh, ever in New York. Yeah. And then. Fire. I came. Because the other days, Benny the Butcher. Because on one of my rhymes, I said, Benny the Butcher, dog. Really, I'm cooking raw. My city, I. Okay. Yep. And then the fans are stuck with the fans. So they call them. And And now we get the butcher coming. Then starts the a butcher's whole, coming. That's right. There. Starts yeah. a whole wave. You know that's what I mean? it. And that's how that happened. I like never told that whole here. story from from Desert Eagle to Benny ah, the Butcher. I never yeah. told that on yeah. camera. Yeah. Hell yeah, that's what we was looking for right there. Yeah. Cause I'm like, yo, he had Benny right two chains. He had Benny from Montana. Oh, yeah, we forgot that. Yeah. See, Come sometimes on, your, this sometimes your names have nicknames. Yeah. <laughs> oh, don't know. Right. So in the Benny acronym days, yo. my nickname was Two Chain Benny Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Benny Main. That's yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. This shit gets this shit gets deep. You can, yeah. 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 Right. This right. name shit get deep. You can right. make it, you can do like how some do and make personalities out of them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That right. shit. So, yo, you I, ever thought about no, making any other type of music other than rap? Uh, no, no, I haven't. I'm not. I'm. 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 I'm not that guy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm, my creative real. process. My creative process doesn't. To be honest with you, doesn't uh, go that far. Besides, mm-hmm. be, be, be me doing it. Yeah, you know what yeah, I'm yeah, saying, yeah, but yeah, I could yeah. produce some shit like that because I could hear it. But be, like me doing it, no. But My you man, produce like, some shit, shit like that? Of course, I've oh, already yeah. done. It's already shit like I produce R and B records before. Yeah. I produce yeah. like auto tune okay. type yeah. records before. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. When I say produce, it's like I don't make beats or nothing like that. But you know what I mean? Like I'm in the studio with artists, with dope artists. Yeah, yeah. I got a whole label. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. You don't gotta you don't gotta rap like Benny the Butcher to be signed a Black no. Soprano fan. Yeah, <laughs> no, right. makes yeah. sense. I work right. with yeah. females. I work with uh, young emo artists. All type of yeah. stuff. Yeah, you, know, you know how this shit go. Uh, you yeah. got you got a, a hell of a lineup in there. Exactly, right. the shit crazy. Mm-hmm. You putting everybody. Yo, people are like yo, the people who not. Everybody want to be BSF, the, but not yeah. putting in the work because all the music goes. It's talking the shit. <laughs> yeah, man. You know this game. What I be want people to know, to know that. This game is 
you gonna get out whatever whatever you put in. Mm-hmm. You know, it's not it, it's not what it look like. You know, it look easy. Look like we just fucking chilling on yachts and beaches right. and shit and spending yeah. money and jewelry. Niggas, that's just like a fucking fifteen second Instagram clip. Talk to yeah. him. Yeah. <laughs> you know right. what I mean? Like you should see what the fuck it's else real. Mm-hmm. We ain't getting sleep. We in the yeah. studio. We sit working. down. We have a meeting. Working. We're studying our craft. No, Since man. what year? 2004. It took you from 2004 mm-hmm. to, to fucking 15 but, to get signed. Right, right, right. And you see the I, work that you put in. Around then, around then, yeah. But I'm sure it was before 2004. Yeah. Yeah, yeah and it was after so you, 15. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> You're still working. Yeah. It's like, man, when I was 16 years old, I had a uh, I had a slot on a radio. You know, when a, a radio, when a six o'clock radio yep. show come on, yeah, and the artist like introduce the show. Yeah, yeah. Yo, I, I was doing that at 16. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Here I am today. I'm uh, 37. So. There you go. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Dude, I think this is a biased opinion, and I hate saying it because people are like, oh, that's because you're from Buffalo." But I think you're the realest to ever do it, bro. I think you keep your no, words the most realest. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, They're like you even reference it. other people instead of saying it's you. I think it's I because mean, like, we got seen a homeboy that'll. Right, right, but, you know what I mean? But it's that's because why y'all you seen call- it, and they're gonna talk about it twenty years from now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. absolutely. But that's why you guys call yourself BSF. It's your family. Yeah, yeah. it really is a family. Yeah, family yeah, really sure. yeah. absolutely. Yep. You know what? That's kind of always been a Buffalo vibe, too, as far as the way exactly. shit works in this city. Family. Mm-hmm. family. You know that. starts family first. You know that. Yep. Mm-hmm. Even from out of town. Well, we got family down there. You yeah, know exactly. what I mean? Right. It's right. Buffalo motherfuckers everywhere. Yeah. There is. There is. Every fucking yeah. There is. When I was growing up, we had a neighbor that was from Buffalo. <laughs> yeah. Well, and I was just in L.A. I, yeah. Mm-hmm. Everybody knows. Yeah, everybody everybody from, has a story. Yeah. About I was Buffalo. just so, like, in fucking. Here you are in California uh-huh. having a neighbor from Buffalo. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And now here I am. Look, living in I was in Vegas, yeah. right? Just I just came from Vegas. Yeah. Right. Got the Airbnb. The Airbnb owners fucking from Buffalo. That's <laughs> fine. <What? laughs> this is crazy. Yeah. That's awesome. That's fine. Yeah. Yeah, like That's all great. set up and shit. Nice little wall of memorabilia. Yeah. Crazy thing. He It was a mansion. And oh. across the street, he lived in the other mansion. I'm yeah. like, man, oh, okay. the Buffalo shit. motherfuckers doing good for themselves. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Man. That's the no, game, man. You gotta get out of it. They got, you got to see beyond Buffalo to get out of Buffalo, though. Yeah. Right, right, but right. you can't leave Buffalo in the rear view. You right. still got to yeah. keep it with you. Well, this is what I learned. If you think, because, you know, this shit, this shit works in Buffalo. Yeah. This type of grind. Y'all see y'all got the Spaced Out podcast. Come this on. Is, this shit is incredible. Coming here, everybody in here working and doing their shit. Working like a team. Yep, yep. Man, what I do, I rap. What athletes do, you know what I'm saying? This shit, mm-hmm. hustlers, what hustlers do. Nigga, this shit work well in Buffalo. Imagine how this shit work out of town. Yeah, yeah. right. Yeah. You know what I mean? right. This shit the bottom. This, yeah. shit, this shit a cakewalk out of town. Yeah. And motherfuckers be surprised by our hustle and, and by our intellect and by just how we move because yeah. we're from the middle of fucking nowhere. Yeah, yeah. 100%. You know what I'm so, That's what it is, yeah. And, 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 that, and that also made it easier for people like us because people set their expectations so fucking low and then it should be way up here. Right. Mm-hmm. I love that shit. Yep. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. Oh yeah, man. That's well, I never looked at it like that. I mean, oh, I always yeah. hear like the typical, oh, you can get hired from my, when you're out of state because they just think we work harder, but even more so to that Buffalonians. You know what I mean? We know what it's like to grind. Yeah, and exactly. Go really it's grind. Grind. it's yeah. a grind. We're going to yeah. do the shit nobody else going to do. Right. That's right. what it is. And That's grind what it is. through the snow. Grind through the snow. Through the motherfucking the weather. seven feet of snow to, mm-hmm. just to get to work still. Mm-hmm. But just to get to work and then yeah. just to get home. And like, that's your lifestyle. Yeah. So when we're given an opportunity to grab some shit, like I was just working hard for nothing. I'm going to damn sure work hard for something. Really. Our yeah. whole city. I mean, our whole city went from being the the number one city in the country yeah. mm-hmm. to just nothing. Oh, yeah, after you we built I mean? that country, right. they And then we've us. had, you know, everybody wants to hit us as Bills fan with yeah, that. Yeah, for real. They don't know. <laughs> oh, See, I remember oh, well, shit like lost, that. You lost four Super Bowls. Man, yeah, fuck them four Super Bowls. We, about to win. we went there four we, times. We went in, what about we're it? winning yeah. in life. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's what I said There's this morning. I told myself that this morning. No Woke doubt. Up, I was right. like, yo, I'm winning in life today. Exactly. Right? It's a good exactly. fucking day. The Bills. It was. I mean, Bills about shit. to win. Bills about to win. I'm already winning. Yeah, I'm in the studio. Exactly. What do you got? Let's give some more local okay. love. Favorite? You got a favorite venue to perform at? Perform for, uh, excuse me. Perform. perform at here in Buffalo? Man, I got to give a shout out to uh, <clears throat> Showplace Theater. Okay. You know I'm saying yeah. they're so supportive. Yeah. They've been doing They're so years. supportive of me and the gang, man. When I say oh, yeah. gang, I don't mean like gang. I mean like the family. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They got me yeah. fucked up already. Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. But it's like, 
man, it, it, it's still hard for people like me. They don't be wanting me to perform at certain yes. spots. Mm-hmm. Right. It's hard because, you know what I'm saying, I, I bring a certain crowd. Yeah, yeah. Yep. And and when I say I bring a certain crowd, not literally with me, coming with me, it's like yeah. the people who the I attract. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yep, yep. Shit. And and drug, dealers, people shit from the drug dealers like concerts. Yeah, yeah. 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 right. Live shows. <laughs> they gonna, they gonna spend money. Yeah. Right. Live shows kids, are good. Speak up kids love live music. Yeah. 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 Not my fault. Thing. Right. No, absolutely. But we man. all behave. Because yeah. you did. There's right. never been no bullshit at none of my right. shows. Nah. No, no, never. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Because it's not like jump around music is like, sometimes I go and I rap at a show and everybody just standing and look at me. That's Listen. how they enjoy the music. Like yeah. this nigga fucking burying his shit. Yeah. 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 I had to I had to learn that. So it was like well, at Showplace Theater, they supported me. Oh, they yeah. perform there. So, so you wonder why I'm doing shit at Showplace, man. That's my spot. I oh, love yeah. them. Shout because you you was looking theater. for spots. I remember yes, that. Yes, I was. I was, I seen that shit. You was like, uh, because they canceled your show. Mm-hmm. Somewhere canceled that shit. Yep. And then you went to a couple different spots and they was telling you no, no. And then they said, fuck me. Yeah. You know what I mean? So and I said, front, fuck them. They fuck and you. did what I had to do. You know what I'm saying? Damn and and looped up with my people. Yeah. And we did sold oh, out yeah. shows ever since then. Oh, yeah. And then they, now they're hitting you up, huh? They're not hitting me up. They're just watching. Did you ever perform yeah. at it? Scornfully. Probably. Probably. <laughs> watching <laughs> bitterly That's in the corner. That is fuck. <laughs> you ever perform at Broadway Joe's? Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. yeah. I was in Yo. a freestyle. I was in a freestyle. Thursday night. I was in a freestyle battle at Broadway Joe's. I'm from the trenches. I did this shit from the bottom. We're bringing that so back. Listen. Wait, yeah. Thursday night. We're opening that place back up. Yep. Yeah. I came oh, through there. You were there? You were there? I've been there. We, that was oh, I'm sure we met back there. then. Hell yeah. Right. Pastime. What was your rap name? And, well... I didn't have one. It was oh. hippie, hippie. Oh, you went by a real name. I, That's I, I went by yeah, my yeah, yeah. Yo, yeah. Everybody was like, yo, Jevin, what's up? Respect. No. Respect, yo. But, yeah. Um, nah, that was Sunday live. That was, that's um, Buffalo Hip Hop. That's, that's Buffalo Hip Hop. That's 100%. You know I mean? Real shit. Dude, they're, it's opening back up, but not bar. It's going to be like a cannabis thing and shit. They got a whole backyard open now. The backyard's not scary yeah, anymore. It's, it's crazy to, to walk into, though. Yeah. Like, yeah. I get But if we open up a spot, where these rappers come? Yeah, yeah, no doubt. I mean, if Why you not? tell them, if you tell them Broadway Joe's is where I got started or whatever, <laughs> you know what I mean? These rappers are too no. bougie nowadays, man. You're right. Yeah. Yeah. They want a bigger stage. Yeah, that's right. You're right. Oh, they must not be paying attention because I see the hard work y'all put in. You know they don't, I, mean? they, I feel like uh, they're not all of them because there are a lot that's investing in themselves. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But there's a lot that are not. Mm-hmm. They don't yeah, want right. to put the money into themselves. Right. They don't no. want to go broke for what they love. Trying exactly. to fucking make the money, and that's crazy to me because look at the look at the reward of it. You yeah, know what I'm right, right. It's gonna <clears throat> for the life that people like me live, or fuck me, like athletes. Look what they got to do. No motherfuckers yeah. rich as a bitch. Mm-hmm. Look mm-hmm. what they got to do. Training mm-hmm. camp Constantly. and all type of crazy shit. Like yeah. what the fuck, I couldn't do no shit like that. Nah, nah. You know I'm fuck, saying fuck, so. Fuck. It's like when you're giving your all to something, your all. Yeah. You know what you're going to get out of that shit. Yeah. But you literally mm-hmm. got to give your all. Everything. It literally okay. come before you, though. A lot of people not ready sure. for it. Right. No. Yeah. This shit come before me. Yeah. It's not my choice. I'm, I'm busy. I'm on a schedule. I'm I'm just doing shit. Like, I'm yeah. I'm, 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 I'm in mode by now. Yeah. Like, I'm a zombie. Yeah, yeah. yeah right? <laughs> right. Sure. I'm not going to lie. Like, I'm just... To turn on you, I'm just I'm awesome. happy for you, though. Not real I mean, shit. Because you got shit to do. Yeah, because it's not about me. It's about legacy. Yeah. This shit got to look. This shit got to go on forever. I'm just getting started. Right. Well, I mean, I, I be that sacrificial land for my yeah. family. You know what I'm saying? For the for the city. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So this shit yeah. can go to so this shit can go the way it needs to go. I'm gonna do what I gotta so do. So far, so good, man. Yeah. yeah. No, I mean, I don't know if it's coincidence, but ever since John Boys, ever since what was it like that? for me, I think I was in California and it was at Cipher where Eminem was like Donald Trump, man, mm-hmm. or whatever he said. Mm-hmm. I was like, oh, that's man. the first time I, I met told him. the wife. I think we gotta go home, yo. <laughs> <laughs> it's time to come back home. Hold on, hold on. That was the home. first time you ever met him. That was the first time I met him that day. Uh-huh. Wow. Fuck. Fire. That's fire. Super fire. Yeah. First time yeah. you get to what spit. It's like, my, 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 Donald Trump. Something like that. <laughs> I don't remember it, but. How'd it go? No. I, it was like, man, it was a, <laughs> Donald Trump. <laughs> just said Donald Trump. Trump. Chief said Donald Trump. Right. <laughs> that's, what, that's, what, that's what the whole nation heard. They went, <laughs> what did he say? Yeah, you know, and then yeah, you're right, all you're right. And, you're right. and then yeah. he went on YouTube and rewound it yeah. like ten times. To no, really what shit. He said. That shit went viral. He knew that, but and that's yeah. why I think yeah. he. We flew in there. You know what I'm saying we flew <laughs> to Detroit to do that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So I think that's why he wanted to have us with him because he knew that he was going. He was going to make a statement. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying yeah. I think 
I think it's that's like so dope though. That's something dope that Eminem did do for Griselda, man. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. Invite us to that BET freestyle. Yeah. That was yeah. crazy. Yeah. That's just yeah. Cannabuff is Western New York's leading independent cannabis magazine. Read about local entrepreneurs, companies in the industry, and learn how you can transition your legacy business into a legitimate licensed player in New York's multi-billion dollar cannabis market. Cannabuff.com also has local news and resources. Check out Benny the Butcher's latest strain or get questions answered about medical cannabis and CBD. Visit Cannabuff.com to subscribe and learn more. From fulfilling your winter needs to summertime feeding the geese. Go check out Monkey Biz Clothing on Instagram for all your seasonally fashionable needs. Monkey Biz Clothing, we're here for the laughs. Yeah, I knew that was coming, you know? I feel like the whole city knew that you boys were about to blow up. But mm -hmm. for me, personally, I know everyone's got their, but like, not that Eminem's my favorite or nothing, but just the fact that it was like, I'm, I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. No, whoa. right. That's, that's, that's smash that's that's yeah. Yeah. Like, no, yeah. You know what? You really got to think about that shit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like, came home. Motherfuckers came in a game with M. Yeah. 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 I M. thought about that shit. Right. Yeah. That's M. crazy. That's yeah. nuts. We're I remember gonna, like opening up a magazine. Gonna, well, I remember man. opening up a magazine when you y'all got signed and I'm like, what? Yeah. Like, you know, like mm -hmm. this, this Buffalo, right? Mm -hmm. yeah, you know, crazy. Right, like, right, right. Kill that. Yeah, just the way they brought it to the light was crazy. We are taking over this going. shit though, man. We doing everything, man. Yeah, yep. This everything. shit ain't gonna stop, man. We 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 hungry, man. We, Yo, we, all yeah. all of y'all putting out so much content. Mm -hmm. It's like you can't even you can't. Yeah, I can't it even keep up. Not exactly. I'm like, yo, yeah. oh, he just dropped. Oh, oh, it's like every three days somebody drops. Well, it's like I'm like constantly like listening to new music. I love it. Yeah, and I was yeah. saying this. It's been five six years since we've been in the game. Yeah. So yeah. you got to put things in context. Yeah. Right. You got West Side Gun. He's walking out during the wrestling shit. Yeah. That was insane. I mean, even more he's for me than what he's doing in Paris. No, like, that's all about to say. He's in fucking Paris. He's fucking yeah. hanging yeah. with Mike Amiri. That's like some right. whole other yeah. shit. Right. And then you got, you got Conway. You see this motherfucker. You see him in the studio with Dre and, and fucking yeah. uh, Kanye. Yeah. Everywhere. Yeah. He's just yeah. in yeah. every studio. You, like, you see that? Just, exactly. Just, and then you got the Butchie. You got there Uncle Butchie. I'm, I just see him everywhere. Did a fucking You're movie. Everywhere too. Did a movie deal. Oh, yeah. Nice. Shit, yeah. Congrats. Conflicted 2 about to come out. Oh, oh yeah. Can't wait. I'm not for even talking about yet. Conflicted 2, though. But that oh, shit going to be oh. crazy. Shout out to Deuce. Yo, that shit. I mean, shout out to AK and Stove. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I, a movie deal. A movie, the movie deal. The fucking Def Jam album. Oh, damn. Yeah, the, the, I can't wait for that Def Jam album. Man. Yeah, man. That shit. Whew. This shit crazy, man. Yeah. Keep hustling. How is it working with Def Jam? I like it. I like it so far. But really, I haven't done nothing yet, but just record some music. Yeah. They, uh, I just went to the studio. Like, <clears throat> after they gave me the advance, the uh, the first business I done with them really was, like, yesterday. Okay. Besides talking to them on the phone, I'm on point with Tunji, Charlene, you know what I'm saying, Arch. Come on. You know what I mean? But uh, like so the first time we opened a budget was just go record with Hitboy. It was a couple of days ago. Mm -hmm. So... We that sounds done so that perfect yet, already. Yeah, we on, we on point. You know what I'm saying? That's dope. Yeah. Met Noah, Lori. You know, I shout out the team. 
I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. Show them love. So, that's dope, though. If that's all they got you doing right now is just making music. That seems like the best place to be. Oh, yeah, I'm cooking up. Yeah. yeah. I'm, cooking yeah, up. Man, I'm not yeah, in no yeah, rush. No. Oh, yeah. It's not like I got to sign the Dev Jam and then drop the album, man. Yeah. No. I'm chilling. I'm about to create some. Yo, I, I, yeah. I recorded some crazy shit. Yeah. A couple oh, days yeah. ago. Oh, me to say. Nice. Let me read nice. that for you. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> I said, well, it says Buffalo has gone, seen his pretty fair share of rough times, no doubt. Mm-hmm. Everyone in this room, I think, can say we came from somewhere where we had to at least put in effort to get where we are now. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. In the city, what do you think needs to happen to help change something like that? You know, What could we do to give more opportunity to people to do more things instead mm-hmm. of just uh, make it to the comfortable hue? You know what I mean? Because that's... That feels like an achievement here in Buffalo. Uh, right, we're paying the bills only. I think. I think uh, first and foremost, we gotta start thinking outside the box. You know what I'm saying? You know, That's coming from a small city comes a uh, small city mentality. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't feel like we all have that. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Nobody in this room have that. Mm-hmm. Well, you know, people like us. You know what I'm saying? We don't. We don't. There's not a lot of people here in, in this type of city. Right. So thinking outside the box. <laughs> Supporting each other, continue to grind, and uh, you know, taking a taking taking advantage of the opportunities that's directly in front of us right now. Mm-hmm. And I'm saying that's important. Yeah, that 100. And uh, networking, connecting with each other, and moving with a purpose. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I know it's scattered and everything like that, but like it could happen. You know yeah. what I'm saying? It's like we need to sit in a, like these people on this side of town need to be in a room with these people on that side of town. You know? Yeah, yes. things need to happen. This shit don't cost no money to. To, to build to shit, come yeah, right. To come together. together. Yeah, no, don't. Zero. Shit is free. Yeah, like discussions. About, like, discussions are free. So it's yeah. about moving with a purpose. Mm-hmm. Are we doing it or are we doing it? Too, in this city is fucking perfect because we got that artistic value heavily here. Yeah, and we need, and we need some rebuilding. Yeah, yeah. What a yeah. perfect time to apply both of those things. You know what I mean? Let's do something different. Man, I think I think I think the city going. You know what I mean? Going to see a change. Because it's already seeing a change. Oh, yeah. I can and, feel uh, it. Situations like <clears throat> ours, as far as Griselda, Black Soprano family, drum work. And situations like the Bills, with Josh mm-hmm. Allen balling, you know, that always creates, like, mm-hmm. energy inside the city. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? like He's saying it without saying it, y'all. You know what's happening this <laughs> right. year. Y'all know what's happening you know this year. What? Real shit. So, I, we've I'm seen it happen in other cities. Say it out loud. Yeah. We've seen it happen Absolutely. in other cities countless times. And oh, I think, yeah. and, and, and it felt like it's happening for us. Dude, it yeah. feels amazing in this right. city right now. Right. So you know what I said is familiar, like, with the whole team that went four times in a row in this team right now is family, yo. This is a yes. squad, yo. <laughs> Instead of just a bunch yeah. of good players together mm-hmm. trying to make it work, this is a family, yo. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's not like the 80s. You know, they ain't going to the clubs and partying like they used to. But uh, hey, he said he was going to it was parties. the 90s. And he was sniffing cocaine. Yeah, there you go. Cocaine, I didn't know if yeah. I was allowed to say it. You can say it. You can say it. You can say it. You can say it. They were doing mad blow in the snow. See, the players go now, they just smoking weed. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, ain't nothing wrong with it. I'm not saying you can't catch touchdowns off cocaine. Yeah, no, it's, it probably, might be easier off weed though. Yeah, yeah. 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 that's yeah. what I'm that's saying. Yeah. You just got sleep the that's night exactly. before; it's probably yeah. easier to catch smoke exactly. weed. Exactly. Balls. <laughs> so no, I, I heard really. the Bills and the Cowboys did that shit together before the Super Bowl. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cowboys must have just had some. Yeah, I know them got some crazy stories from right. the eighties. Right. Dude, my aunt Booty's got some crazy stories <laughs> about <laughs> the Bills from the eighties. I mean, her name's Aunt Booty, so you can oh, imagine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can only imagine. Yeah. Right there. She was probably a lot of fun in the seventies. Exactly. So I have a huge question for you. So you mm-hmm. recently just did a video with Deion Dawkins. Yes, I did. Um, and you were talking about when you were a kid mm-hmm. and emulating like Andre Reid and, mm-hmm. and Thurman Thomas. Who was your favorite? Out of that crew, out of the championship team, man, I would have to say, I would have to say, man, like, got to be Andre Reid. Yes, yeah, okay. Andre hell yeah, Reed, man, because he was an underdog. Yes, but he was he was as good as any as good as anybody though. One hundred, yeah, and uh, solid guy, man. Yep. You know so he's is, my man. favorite. Mm-hmm. He's yeah. my absolute favorite. And, <laughs> I saw um, what your eyes just did right there. Oh, I love him. You know he plays football too, right? 
No, I <laughs> right? see that shit. They rolled into the back of her she head. Like, oh, I love him. No, I mean he was like I literally I've met him a bunch of times, right? Well, sure. And I just sit there Start and calling like you make weird noise. Yeah. No, that's really up no, though. Yeah. That's my guy. Like people don't know how cool he is. He is yes. a good dude, y'all. You know what I'm saying? But I'm like shaking, like. Yeah. Like Mr. Reed, I and I'm saying him and his wife, and I'm saying that yeah. they like family. You know what exactly, I mean? Oh, exactly. Yeah. So, um, ha- like, having met him, uh-huh. or having it like him, like family. When you was he around? Like, I don't know. Did you meet him when you were older? Yeah, I met him when I was older. Okay. I meet him when I was a kid. Right. So did you kind of freak out a little bit, like when you met him at first? I'm like in my head. Yeah, yeah. I don't I think said in my you know head. you know he he, he cool older he a shit. cool dude and shit. Yeah. I don't think he know like probably what he mean to me. You know yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I'm saying he probably be like, okay, Benny the butcher, your rapper. I'm like, nigga, you're a fucking Andre. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, fuck that. He let me put on a fucking yellow jacket. Uh, uh, yeah, shit. Yes. Uh, I put on a yellow jacket. That's crazy. That's gangster shit. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's what I'm trying to say. Like, he cool as fuck. He let me put on a jacket. Yeah. Being allowed. All right. That's what I'm saying. I don't even know. That's some hood shit, right? That's what I'm talking about. Hood shit, right there. Yo, who is your biggest inspiration? No, he has to go. Oh, man, my biggest inspiration. Man, first and foremost, man, my mom. I ain't going to lie, man. Oh, yeah. My mom, Hell yeah. my mom been through a lot, and she always been supportive of other people. You know what I'm saying? So, growing up and being a, a grown ass man, nigga, that's that's hard to do. <laughs> you know yeah. what I'm saying? When you're going through a whole bunch of shit, mm-hmm. my mom had eight kids. Yeah, and you supportive of everybody, and yeah, you're just always in a good mood, and you just a a great person. And you know what I mean, like that take a lot, and. Mm-hmm. I, a lot of a lot of characteristics, like me and my mom, we went into it. We was into it a lot when I was young. But when I got older, I, I realized, like, nigga, you just like her. Maybe uh, that's why you, you know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Yeah. But I realized, like, she the reason that who I, the reason who I am today. You know what I'm saying? I got to yeah. say that. Yeah, she yeah. had the biggest impact on my life. Oh, yeah. You know I'm saying? I can say that. I respect it. Yeah, even down to the rapping. Even she used to encourage me to rap. Yeah. You, know, I, you know, I rap about what I did in the streets as far as hustling, even down to that. Mm-hmm. My, I sold weed for my mother. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm just being real before. Yeah. yeah. So it was like, yeah, she, you know what I mean? She affected my life so much. Shit, you know how it go. So much shit she told me when I was a teenager just happened after I got older. Older when I'm like, damn, I should have just listened to her. Yeah. So Hell yeah. my mom. I, I felt that. Because my, my, my dad's my biggest inspiration. Mm-hmm. And, uh I drove past the shit. I used to live on South Division. Mm-hmm. I drove past the house as I'm driving here, and I heard, I'm proud of you. I'm like, I'm listening to you. And I'm like, <coughs> he ain't listening. Nah, this is just stove guy was just cooking it up. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, oh, <laughs> fuck. And I'm just like, yo, this man knows what I'm doing. Because mm-hmm. I told him as a kid, I was like, yo, I'm going to interview famous people. Mm-hmm. And he was like, all right, but you got to work hard. And like, yo, today I was like, yo, damn. I'm interviewing a fucking famous person. No, that's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Shit is really shit. Full anything could fucking shit. happen. You know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Anything. Oh, yeah. Shit anything. is crazy. Yep. Am I really famous though? I mean, like, hell yeah. I mean, what look, you mean? Yeah. You the, the I mean, UK? I mean, like the whole like UK? Who the I mean, fuck? Let me say. No, you're right. I did. I did perform in Belgium. Yo, yeah. the UK is. Who's the unspoken? You know what I knew when I was famous? You know, it's certain famous moments. Like I, I went to the fight and I set the row behind Madonna. There you go. And then I, I looked, I went to the bathroom, I looked in the mirror, I said, who are you? You know how I got to the fight? I couldn't even buy the tickets. You know how oh. I got to the fight? Floyd gave me the tickets. See? I said, what's wow. going on here? Floyd, yeah. That's what happened? Right there. Right yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. What yeah, the fuck right. happened? Yeah, connecting our dots, you know, here you are sitting right next to me. Like, I'm Yo, like, what? I put it like this. Jim Kelly is like, probably like the unspoken king respect. of our city, right? Jim right. Kelly? Yeah. <clears throat> Uh-huh. That dude ain't even from Buffalo, though. Right, right. Just saying, man. It, I think you hold you hold that spot, bro. I, Listen, maybe not I mean, now, right? But like as you get older, not you now. Stay I'm the home. king of this shit. Yeah. No, I said it. I said yeah, it. I'm the king of this shit. Yes, you Mr. are. Not even, saying, six. not even saying that I want to be. You know what I'm saying? No, yes, you are. But like, there's grandfathers out there that by don't the, know yet. By default. You know what I mean? Yeah, by yeah. default. No I'm was on Ari Melber talking politics. No yeah. doubt. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Talking about our no city. No doubt. I yeah. saw that clip about uh, that. You were talking football the other day. Oh, with, uh, who was that? When Dan that shit happened. happened. When that shit happened at Tops, Did you see I was that? on tour. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I donated money from them shows to that shit. Yeah. Yeah. Put yeah. the song out. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I would, like, when you, do it, when you do a song, 
you're not able to you're not able to use somebody else's beat when you do a song. You know how that shit go. Yeah. Right, 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 right. So now when I, you see when I did the freestyle about it, I use Kendrick's beat. Mm-hmm. Only because mm-hmm. all the money go to, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can earn money on it, but none of that money go to me. Yeah. There's shirts and everything, sold out the shirts, all that type of shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I be yeah. doing shit like that. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah, mad, mad respect. respect. I'm saying, you see when the, uh, Well, when you came out, like when we were in the playoffs, you Man. know, and, and y'all were coming out yeah, and going right. around, like, like Joe shit. Yo, I'm still, I'm still wondering why yeah. the anthem. Oh, why is it not on Instagram, first of all? Yeah, I can't tell. I can't put that shit on any joint and. Nobody can. I can't put it on my stories every Sunday. Why not? It's it won't not let on us. it. Yeah, it won't. Yeah. Uh, the not anthem on is Instagram. not on there. It's not on there. And then it's right not now. the anthem <laughs> right now of Buffalo. Why? I, I, they still playing no. the damn shout song. No, I believe. I believe they're going to catch up. No, they won't. Because nah, nothing that about shit this song. Need to be every no, you're right, every you're, day. You're right, and a lot of people feel like that. But yeah. me being Benny the Butcher, what I see. It's going to spread. You know, that song is going to live on forever. Ever. Yeah, my man. That's my daughter loves it. Runs forever. Runs so, you know, like, six, running around the yo, house. Yeah, my man, Nick, we go crazy mind. on that joint. Man, people don't know, man. Every Sunday night. We own that song. Yeah. You know what I'm yeah. saying? We yeah. own that song. Okay. Yeah. The bills didn't pay me to do that song. No, yeah. right, right, right. Yeah, like, people don't know this shit. No, you, know you know just saying? People think like, yo, he did the Buffalo Bills song. You paid to get on there and everything, right? No, I didn't I didn't pay to get do the song. They said, yo, ask me, though. They I was asked. Do the song, yeah. But you own it. Just we gonna do what we do. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's nice. business. You know what I'm yeah, saying? That's, that's business. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. You feel what I'm saying? But that song is. Oh, aren't you Derek from the Spaced Out Podcast? Oh, yeah. Hey, what's up, man? Here for the Black Friday sale. Got to get here early, you know? Yeah, Black Friday. I'm pretty sure it's it's like you can just kind of come when you want. What? What it's do you mean? A, yeah, no, they'll have enough. Really? It's a nice tent, though. Thanks, bro. I appreciate it, yeah. Are you looking to enhance your cannabis experience? Or maybe you're looking to take a trip to infinity and beyond. Dive into the decadent, delicious treats Space Cadet Edibles has to offer. Space Cadet Edibles can be found on Instagram at space underscore cadet underscore 716. Have you met the incredible, sometimes edible, just incredibles? Western New York's source for top quality hash rosin. Just Incredibles is the one-stop shop for all of your favorite brands. One of my favorite brands is Western New York Terps. And oh yeah, he's got that too. They set the standards on premium terpy rosin. Their edibles are also infused with high quality rosin that'll smack you on your, hold on now. Go follow at Justin underscore Credibles and at Say Hi Buffalo on IG for some incredible events. It's going to live on forever. And I'm not going to lie. I do see like little white kids dancing going crazy yeah. that's, that's my sister watch tomorrow daughter. watch yeah. tomorrow yeah. watch sister. tomorrow it's gonna yeah. be lit it's gonna yeah. be so many people oh my God, yeah. tagging me in that song it's yeah. gonna be crazy oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. but the only thing is is that instagram don't got that shit so we gotta play it exactly and you know what i gotta call jake yeah jake is go. the president of black soprano family you know what i'm mm-hmm. saying that's his job we need that to be but you know what i'm saying because i don't give a fuck about the money from that song yeah you know what i'm saying like the the money, the, the, money that, like the money that came in from that song, I gave it to the person who produced it, mm-hmm. and then I gave it to like somebody. You hear, you hear the guys on the hook. We all yelling. I gave it to uh, one of the guys who who helped me like put that together. Nice. You feel what I'm saying? It's like I don't give a yeah, fuck yeah, about yeah. that. Like I'm too much of a Bills fan to care about a fucking yeah. song. Like I'm exactly. Yeah. Like, what the oh, fuck? Yeah. You know what I mean? Do that real exactly. quick. That shit. Hell yeah. Yeah. Even them coming to you real and saying, shit. "Hey, do this music." That's right. enough for me. Yeah. Yeah. It's like real shit. We gonna give you the field. We gonna give you everything to shoot the video. They let me in the fucking locker room. I was standing at Josh Allen locker. Like that. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. I yeah. played it on my radio Deion show. Is in there with me, my gang. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That shit crazy. Yeah. That's love. Did oh, you guys exactly. catch that last week? What? I played it on my radio show. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I did oh, a yeah. whole a whole reggae show, right? And then the last song, <laughs> last song, the last song, last song was the Bills anthem. That's fire. Yeah. Yeah. But this yeah. week it got so my, number one. My show airs in Kansas City, and I've never played a Kansas City artist. That's where you're from. No, nah, I'm, I'm from Oakland. I'm from, I'm from Southern California. Okay. 
but uh, I, I only play uh, Buffalo artists. Yeah, my man. If you, <laughs> yeah, if you listen to Double F up the rotation, it's all. You just on Buffalo, Kansas, Kansas City. Now what is it? They're yeah. loving it. Don't F up the rotation. Uh, my boy, I started a radio station out there called the Five XL, mm-hmm. and uh, he like. No, we're gonna get you. We're gonna get some shit to you then. Uh-huh. Yeah. Some exclusive shit. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah, uh-huh. I'm with shit. that. I'm with that. We'll talk. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, man. No, they don't them. complain either. They nope. love it as they should. Yep. Nope. Yeah. They never played a Tech Nine joint. I've never played Tech Nine joint. <laughs> <laughs> you're so you're ignorant about that shit. Yeah, you man, gotta stop. Why you play Tech, man? Yeah, that's it's, what I'm saying. I understand. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They be sleeping on my man. He's, my it's an art piece. It's an art piece for him to not play Kansas. Don't get me wrong. I love Tech. I love tech, but like I don't know, like you know, I hit play. I'm in my bedroom, you know, on the west side, chilling. Yeah, you know, taking bong grips, and I'm like, yo, he plays, he plays fucking Griselda. He plays Griselda. Yeah. Fuck it. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> the world needs to know. Yeah. They do. Exactly. Kansas City already knows about Tech Nine. <coughs> yeah, exactly. No, they know about Griselda. What's your favorite now? local restaurant? Ooh. I like that. My favorite sure. local restaurant. Who the fuck calling me right now? No, you're good. I thought it was me. You're yeah. all right. Oh, I'm fired if that shit happens to me right now. <laughs> I'm fired. <laughs> <laughs> no, you got to go in the corner if that's what happens. I'm fired. He's like, I'm done. You got to go in the corner. Man, I would say, man, it's not no soul food restaurants, man. They be opening and closing, man. Yeah. God damn. I'm going to have to open one of them motherfuckers up. For yeah. sure. For yeah. sure. Yes. Oh, my God, please. That's I would say, I can be G's, but I can be G's. I can be G mm. on Montana, oh, yeah. on Montana and Genesee. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it's, it's mm. in my hood, and, and I was raised on that. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Ike used to bring us the food at the end of the night. He used to bring it to my mom when I was a kid. That's fine. But I go there, I get the ribs, I get the motherfucking, I get the macaroni and cheese, I get the potato salad. Exactly they got all the shit. That's where I go to. That's like. Huh? I think I'm I go going there. there after. I'm no, going there. Shit. That's exactly what I'm ordering. And they be having the, they have the grill out there smoking. Yeah. You ever fuck with IMBG? Exactly. I go to IMBG. When, when I go to the VA, every time I hit the VA, mm-hmm. passing that shit, I'm like, God damn. <laughs> no real <laughs> shit. And, and that sub joint, too. Which one is that? Uh, The sub, uh, what's that sub spot that's right on the corner right there? You're talking about Shy's? Yeah. Everybody nah. loves Shy's. Yeah, Shy's a good yeah. spot, too. They the, the shit. Shy's a good spot. Uh, What else? Man, what are, it's some other spots. Of course, Lenovo's. These places that, you know, I, I I got a spot here, but I live in Atlanta. So these right. are places that I got to go to when I get here. Yeah. Man. I go to Ted. I got to go to Ted's. I walked, oh, in Ted's yeah. one, I walked in Ted's one time and bought everybody food. Yeah. Yeah. I thought I was, yo, I thought I was doing, I thought I was doing something big. That shit was like 80 bucks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's the best, yo. That's the best, you're like, shit, right on. <laughs> no, no, no. said that about Buffalo. I was like, man, if you got, if you got nothing holding you down here, get out there and fucking reach for more. In the worst case scenario, you come back to like the cheapest city to live in. Yeah, no, real shit. Like, this is the place where you yeah. come back, go live in Mines. You'll be in your own place in a month. You go Not get a pizza shit. from any right. corner for ten dollars. Mm-hmm. That's yeah. a fact. Oh, yeah. oh yeah, you can, can still get off the books jobs over here. Pizza and shit. Off now, yeah. day. True, true. Go work in a collection agency in the cut. I can go either right. way in my neighborhood and get to a corner so store. Here's the other, Yo, yeah. the yeah. other big question. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Is where can we get your pack? Benny the Butcher. Uh-huh. Strains a week, uh-huh. right? Mm-hmm. So yeah. there's Butcher's Breath. Mm-hmm. And a lot of people around here say they got it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They definitely don't. <laughs> oh, shit. I didn't know oh. they were this up. No, no. Oh, it'd be, no, it'd be a lot of cap. It. Of course. It'd yeah. be a lot of cap. Yeah. Oh. Yo, um, they be having the wrong bags. They be having the wrong bags. It be a lot of cap, but there are places you can get them. Who there is are it? Places you can get them. Rappers first yeah. choice, right? Is that rappers one? first choice. That's the mm-hmm. first sign. Mm-hmm. It has to be rappers first choice. Mm-hmm. And we just got new bags. Oh yeah, I seen those. Mm-hmm. It looks like that. And, uh, and cha, cha, cha. It's a new strain, so yeah. Nice. I mean, there yeah, are right. there are people who got them, <coughs> and you know we'll elaborate further on that later on. All right, yeah, because yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. they now you know they 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 they're running the muck. Yeah, I think I can buy some empty bags at uh, that joint on Niagara Street at the end of Hurdle. I think <laughs> I you sure can. can. No, no can. listen, no joke. If yeah, you if 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 you're a bootlegger and you're bootlegging bags, 
if you're not bootlegging the Benny the Butcher bags, I'm offended. Yeah, right. there you go. Right. Go get your yeah, that's a right bag too. Right. I'm offended. Right. Because like it's the best bags. shit smoking. Yeah. But if you a smoker, you could tell. You know what I'm saying? You gonna know like, yeah, is this it? But, I, but it's a, it's it's like, trust me. Yeah. No. If you rhyme. got them right next to each other, it's like, oh, okay. yeah. Clearly, right. You know, exactly. That happened to my homeboy. Mike. Quality. You know, I'm a real uh, marijuana connoisseur. <clears throat> I'm about to say, I'm aligned with like, smoking right there. <clears throat> exactly. I'm aligned with different marijuana companies from okay. Pac-Was, the rapper first choice, to now Smokers Club. You know what you I'm saying? Was, Burner yeah, is yeah. my homie. Yeah, yeah. You feel me? Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, I smoked a joint with Wiz Khalifa at Diddy House. Oh. Yeah. So I what, are, what are we talking? Am I qualified or not? Yeah, yeah. for real. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. What is going on? Approved, I'm fucking brew like in his bag. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So you know what I mean. So I get it, but I'm gonna make sure if I'm if I if I stamp something, it, it's gonna be quality. You know yeah. What I'm saying? Real yeah. shit. Yeah, absolutely. And I, and I got asthma too, so I can't be. I was just, yo, that was my. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, I was about to say, does yeah. the yeah. asthma does it help with your asthma? Or does it make fuck it worse? No, no. no. <laughs> he said, fuck no, because some people he said, be like, yo, uh, that shit helped my asthma. I'm like, yo, how? No, they just talking about say, it. <laughs> How the fuck that shit helping your it asthma? Help my asthma because I be too high to give a fuck. <laughs> 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 be like, <laughs> can I fuck that shit? I'm going to bed. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, I can't. I'm going. I don't, I don't care about that. Right. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> that's. Cool. I help my. I'm like, how the fuck it help your asthma? Because I don't give a fuck, mama. I need to smoke. This yeah, shit. for yeah. real, right? Um, going through dog walkers all day, huh? All day, I smoke thirty of these bitches. Right. Uh, so does it help with your asthma? <laughs> <laughs> does it help with your asthma? <laughs> it doesn't help with your uh, memory. <clears throat> no, 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 not no, mine. No, my no, shit no. is shot, yo. I don't remember shit till a week later. I don't remember right. shit till oh, here I got one. I got one. Um, Al Green or Marvin Gaye. Um, Al Green or Marvin Gaye. I gotta go Al Green because DJ Shea sampled him on Crowns for Kings. Yo, yo, my man, Al right Green. Here. My yep. girl, yo, you understand? Oh, this yeah. man right here. He said, Let's hear his little. <clears throat> I ain't doing no Al Green. Come on, you can do it. No, I ain't doing no Al Green. I'll do it. Wow, wow. Right? Yeah, but, we, but I don't do it. Without that. that button wow. work, I can only do it after the buttons push. Oh, sorry. Oh. So Push the button. His, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Yeah. 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 Nah, nah, forget, forget it. it. I don't know which, which button. I thought they're though. supposed to be ready for that oh, shit. Oh, this button. Yeah. No. <laughs> Not that way. Oh, you might as well. All right, all right. Let's forget it. It's too loud. <laughs> that, was really loud. that sound was perfect for your performance. So. <laughs> oh, <laughs> damn. Ouch. I'm just, Ouch. you know, I'm witty. I gotta say it when it comes Sheesh. to my brain. I get, I get it. He Sheesh. said, he said your exactly. button pushing was lackluster. Lackluster. Um, lackluster. He, he was one yeah. right here, man. There's no peaking. All Shit. Oh, right. we're peaking right now. <laughs> kidding me? Fuck, I peaked with my shrooms as soon as Benny got here. What are you not supposed to take shrooms? This is a professional hey, setting. Hey, listen <laughs> here. If I don't take my shrooms, I'll be fucking crazy. Mm, fucking, I guess. Yeah. I'm not going to be able to. Micro dose. Yeah. Here, so, fucking. what kind of lessons do you want to pass on to your daughter? Oh. oh man, question. that's a great Damn. fucking question. That is a wonderful question. Well, look, the lesson I want to pass on to my daughter is the you can have whatever you want to have. Go get it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because that's important. Because I'm, Hell yeah. That's important to me because what kind of family I'm from. And she got opportunities that I didn't have. I'm saying she's going to be able to go to any college she want. Oh, yeah. Me and her talk about business plans all the time. So I tell her, like, take advantage of that shit. It's regular yeah. to yeah. you because I'm your father, but that's not regular to people. Right. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying, like, trying to explain that to her. Yeah. Congratulations. Uh, you you dude, got that's access so huge to, to be able exactly. to do that for your kid, man. I mean, so do you I even have to work do anymore? Like, I want it to work. So, you know what I'm right. saying? I tell her, like, you know, do something in life. You know what I mean? They don't, oh, yeah. I don't want to put too much pressure on her, but I'm like, you know, do something yeah, in life because you can. Like oh, yeah. Two at a time. Real shit. Especially this city, man. I smoked money. A bunch of opportunity came us. It's slim around this motherfucker. It's a thing. Yo, it's hard as fuck. It's not my thing. You know, we from. we from. get rid of it for you? We from places where. But I don't want you know, we like getting in the streets. Getting in the streets was, you know, forced upon. You know what I mean? People right. like me. Yeah. You know right. what I mean? You know, like dealing with peer pressure and shit like that. Yeah. You know, that's real. I ain't talking no. about I ain't, as a 20 year old. I'm talking about like, like 12 or 13. You yeah. Know, you yeah. Dealing with shit yeah. like that. Heavy influence. You know, this shit. I mean, this shit where I was from, that shit was like Compton. 
Yeah. 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 I was just going to say, like, you should just go check Montana. No joke. I live just check South Montana Division, Street. Right mm-hmm. here. Like, oh. mm-hmm. um, right before the bridge. And the shit, my dad was strict as fuck. Mm-hmm. So, like, I'm surrounded by downtown, Swan, 33, mm-hmm. all surrounding me. And it's, like, pulling me this way, that way, this mm-hmm. way, that way. And my dad is right there, like, nah. Mm-hmm. You're doing this. You're doing that. Thank God I had my dad right there doing that shit because it would have been over. Mm-hmm. No, like, you're right. Life would have right. been fucking way different than it is right now. And that's easy. And that's easy to to happen when you coming up in that yeah. type of environment yeah. because it's everybody doing it. Mm-hmm. Everybody got a gun. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Everybody selling dope. Everybody doing robberies. So, and then when you make it to a different position in life, you're like, no, nobody was doing that shit but us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm saying. But us. Yeah. And that, yeah. Part of when time. You zoom out, mm-hmm. and I'm saying like real shit yeah. though. Yeah. People was getting money. That's that's what I'm realizing. People getting money different type of ways. Yeah, mm-hmm. I think the rest of the world realizing that too. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Yeah. It's just that opportunities got to be provided. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And just you know just shit like this, curating shit, putting it together. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. possible. You know, mm-hmm. like you're you saying, know, it's you never know what this shit could go go to. Because I'm about to start me a sports podcast. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Shit yeah. crazy. I'm only gonna do it during the season. Guy. We know a guy that does it. Yeah, we know a guy. <laughs> yeah. Nice, nice. During the season, I'm gonna fuck with it. Yeah, you definitely yeah. should. Make that shit crazy. I mean, that's yeah. true. Yeah. Yeah. You know why tough. that's smart? Because Buffalo fans, mm-hmm. they wanna hear that you, they wanna fuck with you, wanna mm-hmm. fuck with the Bills. Seems perfect. Yeah. yeah. And on Jalen and Jacoby, I take this shit serious. Yeah, you're the uh, I'm the, the correspondent. Man, I watched Bills that. Bills correspondent. Yo. Yeah, the senior Bills correspondent. This is going to start Jacoby. bi-weekly. Yeah. This yeah. is going to be a bi-weekly thing. Was that the first one? Oh, all right. That was like the first one. The first one? This year uh, watch. Right. Watch. Mm. watch. Watch the next one. Yeah, yeah. When I got okay. my suit on. They oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Watch shit. this. Watch you coming with the mob suit, though? Watch this. I'm coming with the suit. I'm going to have the papers ready. I'm going to watch this. Yeah. Yeah, you got to come with the the buffalo type, like old school buffalo mob suit on, though. No, he's he's a businessman right now. He's he's securing his position. I'm going to have a a big ass chain on still. A big ass chain, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, like we still do the other shit. But if they're like, though, we want to take you on for 20 years, what do you say? You'd be like, let me put my chain in. Just tuck it inside and stand out there. Yeah, for no. That's what they gonna want. No, no. If, they, if they wanna hire me, that's what they're gonna hire. They hire in the chain too. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Real is <laughs> out. I'm telling yeah, you. Shout out to your jewelry. Right, Them shits are shiny. Yeah, I mean these these is both special pieces. Oh, yeah. mm-hmm. Mateo you know made it? Mateo made this one. Yeah. Well, definitely Mateo made this one. Black Soprano family yeah. piece. No, Small man. joint, you know, Montana. Uh, this is like this this Buffalo shit. This is Montana yeah, Avenue. Yeah, Black yeah, Soprano yeah, family, yeah. all Buffalo shit. Yeah. Yo, I got uh, Love it. I got a rap. Go ahead. Oh, okay. here we go. It's my yeah. first rap ever. Oh, yeah. It's your first rap ever? No. Yeah. And you gonna no. rap at the Benny the Butcher? Yeah. No, no. He mean uh, like the first one not? he ever wrote. Oh, because I'm gonna ask you because I'm gonna ask you maybe what your first rap ever, if you remember it. So here it goes. It's stupid. Oh. It goes, I move fast like a jet. When you come to my hood, you better not step because I'm the hardest dude that you ever met. <laughs> that you ever will meet. That's it. It's horrible. How old I know. you wrote that? I was like probably 30. 12 Mike behind my friend. You got him back. That was a good You got him back. Uh, no, I was like 12 behind Man of Bruce's back, in Man of Bruce's backyard in between the pool. I wrote some shit smoking a cigarette. I wrote some shit back in the day, my first shit. I'm not reciting that motherfucker. (laughs) (laughs) uh, I'm not getting that. Give give us your first cool one. I can't even remember that motherfucker. But but your mom made you come downstairs and rap that shit, right? Uh, Oh, come on. It was good enough for my. Yo. Oh, that's <laughs> Yo, I was shit, a baby boy. That shit's fire. I was though. a baby boy, but like my first shit that I recorded in the uh, studio, that shit was on a mixtape. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 I wasn't fucking around. I ain't yeah. I nah, nah. Sure yeah. Yeah. fucking around. Oh, yeah. So you can find it. So if you do enough digging, y'all, you can find nah, it. Nah, somebody yeah. got these tapes, yo, and whoever got them shits, I need a copy of the, from oh, the shit. beginning to now. Me too. Where are you? Let's get some money together. Yeah. Oh, yeah. For real. Yeah. Yeah. Them, yo, that one that's it with the. With the acronym on the front, mm-hmm. I think that that was the name of the tape. Yeah, Benny. Yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. And then, yo, I think someone drew like the cities in the back of it or some shit. It has something in the back of it. I think so, man. I had so many tapes and so many. Hmm. Uh, man, CD I remember this shit because my brother brought this shit and he put it was putting it in and I'm like, yo, what is that? Because like 
first time seeing mixtapes from the fucking corner store, like, being put in there. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, yo, okay. And I'm listening to it, and I'm like, yo, this shit's fire. No, I need I always, to find that shit. I've always been a student of this shit, man, studying and trying to get my pen to an elite level. That's yeah. always been important to me. You know what I'm saying? I've always done that ever since I jumped in. Oh, yeah. Nah, even then, that shit in tune. Yo, if you hear these shits, you're going to go crazy. Like, damn, wow. he was writing like this then. So, man, must have been Yo, he was ahead of his time back noise. then, I feel like. So, so that's what I mean. Buffalo, man, for me, I've said it before. It's like we never, like, we've definitely adapted. But it's like Buffalo never left the 90s hip-hop scene. We just waited for it to circle back around. Did yeah, that's what that? happened. I agree with it because, like, the <clears throat> the artists who do other music in Buffalo, yep. they, have, they haven't really, I mean, they haven't really... Mm-hmm. Worked out. Not saying not worked out for the here. You know what I mean? We have our own level underground, of underground shit. shit. Exactly. Mm-hmm. And Buffalo always been built on underground. Hell yeah. 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 You know what I'm saying? Like people don't even know this shit, but like, it's always been that type of city. Yeah. Like and listen that to Broadway this Joe shit. shit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Just the influence off the. Remember off the wall. I like, had this, I like uh, listening DJ to battle. artists from Buffalo. Mm-hmm. Like mm-hmm. listening to finding new artists and shit. People who just fucking spit going to. Uh, that joint in Niagara Falls, they uh, be doing that stamps. Mm-hmm. The artists just be popping up there. They be doing shows. And I'm like, yo, damn. But these niggas, but the artists who do the other music, they got to work harder. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So then they got to work harder. They got to get their hustle together. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If they want to be in a uh, better position than they in. You Is there anybody from Buffalo that you looking at? Outside that you see that's course. like, damn, Outside you working. Yeah. Yeah. We already know you fuck with Bliss. Bliss work hard as fuck. Bro, him, and Ponzo work hard. Ponzo yeah, Dino, Ponzo, yeah. He work hard. Uh, man, it's a whole bunch of names. I can't, I'm trying to think. You know, I smoke too much fucking weed. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. Because I don't want to say it's not no niggas. It's a bunch of niggas. There's some yeah, young yeah. niggas going on. I'm trying to think of them niggas' name. I don't know their name, but they smoking shit right now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Who else? Who else? Uh... My boy yeah. Los Los Toast be on Facebook. He be talking shit like, yeah. God, yo, yo Los like, be all crazy. over. Yo, I'll get crazy. I had to refriend him and unfriend him again. <laughs> yeah. dude. Every I'm time like, he hates on the bills, I'm like, bah. and he's like, bah. and I'm like, oh, he's not gonna stop. I'm so he, I mean, <laughs> he's not he, like, stop. he definitely a person who like, yeah, who gonna talk his shit and, and, I and fuck keep with going. Him, no. I who do. else? <clears throat> yeah, I uh, fuck with Los Shane Grams, man. Shane Grams, definitely. Uh, who the Shane fuck else, Rams. man? Let me see. Shane Grams. I haven't heard that name yet. You ain't never heard Shane Nah. Grams. Google nah, it. you said that shit now, God. Benny said You, don't, you can wait. No, no, don't Google Shane Grams. We don't who need who that the fuck else, man? <laughs> Damn. Because there's a bunch of motherfuckers right now. I ain't going to lie. We had some artists on this yeah. show. Shogun Wiz. Shogun Wiz. I'm going to sign some Wiz. niggas. I'm going to sign somebody else from Buffalo. I'm going to sign like some kids who I don't even fucking know. We'll see what Shogun and Wiz can do. I tell you that only because I'm like, man, this guy works. Mm-hmm. He definitely works. I think he carries being a mm-hmm. hip hop artist with him all day. Uh, Go- yeah. Just John- Google it. Johnny Honest. <laughs> Johnny Honest. Yeah. Johnny Honest. Mm-hmm. Johnny Honest. He's a hard working dude. Hard working. Hard working. Yeah. Any fucking a garbage man still. Yep. Yeah. No, that's a hustler. He grinding. Yeah. yeah. No doubt. Major. He putting in work. Uh, who else Good we got? Dude. Damn. <coughs> I'm who else, man? Fuck. Me too, man. Like, who that, who else we got, man? I want to know who the fuck, who the, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I got to tap right in. Percent. I got to be more tapped in. Who pay for Nas? I just got to think. But you know what? Because only mm-hmm. because me and my niggas be really running this shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's what I was saying. Yeah. So I right. get kind of It's, hard. Hard. it's, it's a bunch of us. It's a lot of us. It's not even, it's not even harder to listen to other people. It's just like. The people on my roster are not on there for nothing. Yeah, you know? right. You know what I mean, like, I'm I'm impressed with Rick High Talent. You know what I'm saying, yeah, I'm Young World. Really people don't even know this nigga. Young, young World is young incredibly world is talented. Yep. It's He's talented. Raw. You feel yeah. what I'm saying? So it's yeah. like, you know what I mean? I fuck with them. I'm waiting. I'm waiting for them to uh, come out. They shit. Yeah, Heem is crazy. He he was he is putting on. People going crazy for him. We about to drop the video soon. So oh yeah, yeah. Heem mm. Heem is a monster. Went to get him out of here, right? Mm. Yeah, so I know we were talking about it. Uh, we were. Indeed. Yo, you know who I like. I just want to mention because y'all fuck with him. Yeah. Stove God, and you mentioned it. Yeah. Stove God cooks, man. Like I don't, that dude is original. Yeah, he goes crazy. Fuck, yo. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, absolute original. Monster, right? That shit. Yo, that in the church parking lot. 
We all do. Right. Yo, I like, I, 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 I like how you curated that uh, Tana Talk Four. Like how, yeah. like you yeah. got mm-hmm. the first song, Johnny P. Caddy. Mm-hmm. You got Cole going fucking bananas stupid. on that shit. Stupid. Yo, now hold on, hold on, hold no. on, because this man disagrees. Wow, I was gonna. Did the man go in? No, no, no. If you're gonna did say you, it, did say you change? Did you almost change your voice you at all? I'm gonna call you Fuck out if no. you don't say it. I wouldn't think you would. My, I, I could would never. I could yo, never but that change shit my was. Verse. Yo, you went hard, and then he just came in, and I was like, Who you, "Whose what? verse was better?" Yo, Cole went stupid. Oh my yo, god, you my fucking yo, you I my god. Like but well, Cole went stupid. As a sure, sure, that's that's the type of arena that we, that yo, we but set. That's what yeah, I'm saying. It's yeah, like they right. the they boxing in a fucking. You're disrespectful. It's not, yo. He a fucking monster. And, and to be honest with you, I'm I'm not even I'm not even boxing. You know mm-hmm. what I'm yeah. saying? Yo, like any anytime you anytime my name come into play with anything, it's gonna be amongst giants. Yeah, mm-hmm. it's gonna be Absolutely. it's gonna be amongst people who accomplish. Mm-hmm. It's gonna That's be amongst true. people who accomplish ten times more than yeah. what I. Yeah. Look at the BET nominations. Look who I'm in, yeah. who, who I'm in the box there. Yeah, everybody got plaques. Three of them, three of them, right? Three of them. Everybody got plaques. The last BT Awards, nigga, I, I lost to Mulatto. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. she, she damn near a pop artist. Mm-hmm. And yeah. Tim's, them damn near pop artists. So, trust me, the, the, yeah. the my name in this shit is known for, mm-hmm. when you do a song, when I, when you want some shit with me, like, yeah. you're going to spit mm-hmm. some of your best shit. Yep, sure. best. How much you that charging? Sure. Really, uh, to be honest with you, I'm charging like 20k a verse. Yeah. Oh, 20k a verse. Point. That's what uh, I, I asked. asked you. I asked your Instagram years worth ago, it. and that's what that's what you said. <laughs> that's, what someone, yeah. that's what someone said. Right. Yo, even the worst nah, but Cole, people. Cole is one of the best in the game. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Don't don't Yo. don't ever get that confused. Mm-hmm. He's and, not. And, and, and it was he, just he, like he, he not he not he not two. Yeah. You know what I'm saying for right now, for he, he's not two. Mm-hmm. And uh. He that nigga, you know what I mean? I'm yeah, only, I'm mm-hmm. only, I'm only like working with them type of artists. Yo, you got yo, the even the, even the guys like each other too on even, that shit. That's a fact. But even from guys like Graf, mm-hmm. yes. yeah, like a nigga like that, his lyrical ability. Yeah, I'm, he, I'm working with niggas who got crazy lyrical crazy. ability. Yep, yeah, who I can be inspired yeah. of. You know what I'm saying real that's shit. Push it all right. See? So, so people who really inspire what's, you. what's going on next for you? Uh, well, I'm doing the Dev Jam album. Uh, I'm about to start shooting this movie. I'm about to start shooting Conflicted too. I'm doing oh, a lot bro. of movies. Uh, if you need a goofy white dude to be that. Um, no, I'm gonna have your people. Know. I'm gonna have my people contact yeah. your people. I do. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh man, I'll, I'll give it. While to you Monday. while you're rapping, that rapping. Oh, yeah. 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 What else, man? You know we got the sports agency. You know what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's uh, a big. We always yeah. scouting talent. We always scouting talent. It's more about branding and merchandising. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm nice. saying. Uh, you know, movies, merch, oh, yeah, everything. music, I'm signing artists, you podcasts. know what I'm saying? And just all of that shit, podcasts. Oh, yeah. We just hustling, man. We getting our hands on everything. Yeah. Man. Yeah. Yeah. Real That's shit. That's the way to do it. If it makes yeah. money, it makes well, sense. Well, locally, where can people get your merch? Uh, nowhere it's online. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No. Yeah. And you, you can. Get a you need that local store. Store. Yeah, we got to hit that link. You got to hit that yeah. link. We got to keep everything I'm exclusive. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Real shit. Yeah. Shit okay. makes its way to some of the stores around here, you know what I mean? No, I know. By way, but yeah, they got, you know, they just got to win it on the internet. Yeah. That resale way is mm-hmm. crazy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so this, my well, boy Jake it. hooked us up with all these, well, hooked me up with all the hats. And yeah, those nice. Oh, you yeah. see those? That's a, those nice hats. Oh, yeah. Shout out Westside Gun Conway, man. No doubt. Motherfucking yeah. everybody in Buffalo. Shout out to motherfucking uh, Montana Ave. Shout out to motherfucking... Newburg and Delavan. Shout out to motherfucking Lenovas. Yeah. Shout out uh, Germany. That's my daughter. Shout out Kiera. That's my other baby. Oh, yeah. Shout out oh. everybody, man. You know yeah. what I mean? Benny the fucking butcher. That's what the fuck fucking I do. Butcher. Yeah. Ah, the butcher's yeah. coming, y'all. He's here. He's here. here. He's, He's here. He's coming to y'all. Yeah. Yeah, man. Come on, we, doing? we ain't watching the fucking game. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. We're about to go there. Go well, tell yeah, me. we're going to do some. I'm going to uh, tackle somebody down that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Hell yeah. I'm coming. Jump yeah. to a table, anybody? So, yeah, she's like, no, you ain't. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, yeah. you hey. can tackle me, shit. Just throw me through. You want to throw me through a table there? Nah, I ain't doing that on camera. Man. Yeah, right, right. right. You, know the, you, know the, the, you know the real Buffalo Bills organization <laughs> shunned <laughs> out. Of course. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And that I'm made motherfuckers go harder. I'm involved with the Pagulias. I can't be doing that. Yeah, yeah. 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 No, no, no. Oh. Tables? yeah me yeah. neither. Yeah. Now, look, Bills <laughs> Mafia fans, y'all some crazy motherfuckers, man. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And, and keep going crazy for the Bills and... And just keep grinding for us, man. Cause hell yeah, they be needing that. You know, yeah. Yeah. Look, I was in video? Kansas City. I was in Kansas City for the AFC Championship game. Uh. Mm-hmm. Harsh conditions, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah. to have that fan support, man, that's crazy. So man, we get the Bills Mafia. Mm-hmm. Keep slamming motherfuckers through tables. Yeah. Keep showing up, going crazy. Everything. Just don't oh, tell yeah. anybody. Yeah. Who told you to do it. Right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we appreciate yeah. you for coming out yeah, yeah, and and stopping Absolutely. by, you know, spaced out while you while you're in town. Hell yeah, I, I appreciate y'all. Yeah. All love, dope podcast, man. I wish y'all the best of luck and keep grinding. Yeah, yeah, man. Man. I appreciate Whenever you. you, you keep back. fucking putting. I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna come back and talk about these movies. I'm trying to tell you, I'm doing a movie. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 No, I'm about to fucking quit rapping. I'm turning into fucking Tyler Perry on this bitch. Yeah. 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 Let's do it. Yeah.